The Republic of Kazakhstan is one of the richest countries in mineral resources. Its reserves will last for more than 100 years. According to expert estimates, our country ranks sixth according to the world reserves of natural resources, which are estimated at about 10 trillion US dollars. Of the 110 elements of their periodic table, Kazakhstan has 99 elements. 70 of them are explored, but only 60 of them are being extracted and used. Sedimentary minerals dominated by oil and gas, black and brown coal, phosphates, bauxite and salt. The presence of rich deposits of various ores form the basis for the development of ferrous and non-ferrous metallurgy. One of our main wealth, oil and gas and coal. In view of the proven and estimated reserves on land, expert oil reserves in the country are more than 6 billion tons, gas reserves 6 trillion cubic meters. The most important period is the period from 1999 to 2014, when Kazakhstan had a dynamic production growth. With growing world oil prices, and this has created the conditions for an active geological exploration, field development, the development of new projects, both in production and in processing. During this period, we were actively working and on the Caspian Shelf. Oil in Kazakhstan is not only produced and exported, but also is being processed. The country today has three oil refineries, Atrao, Pavlodar and Shimkent refineries. One of Kazakhstan's largest companies for production of petroleum products, Pavlodar Petrochemical Plant, has an oil processing depth of 85%. In this and other refineries, gasoline, jet fuel, diesel, fuel oil, liquefied gas, vitamin, coke, sulfur of various brands are produced. Two years ago, we celebrated the Great Jubilee, the 35th anniversary of the plant. In 2009, in September, 100 shareholders of the plant became the company Kazmunai Gas. That is, the plant was taken over by the state. And from that moment, a new history of the plant began. Что проделано за этот период пять лет? Over the five-year period, it is a period when people usually make conclusions. If you say, in terms of figures, over the five years the company has invested in the framework of major repairs and improvements to the current fund for the production more than 400 million US dollars. This is a large amount of money. It was utilized by 100 percent. As for the modernization of this big project, at the moment it is now in a full swing. Что касается модернизации этого большого проекта нашего, то он сейчас находится на полном ходу. In addition to oil, large reserves of other energy sources, various kinds of coal, are being explored on the territory of the Republic. Kazakhstan has opened more than 100 coal deposits, the largest of which is the Ekebastus deposit, characterized by high-power brown coal seams and Karaganda coal basin, with reserves of over 50 billion tons of coke in coal. In our country, there is a significant portion of the world's reserves of copper and polymetallic ores, nickel, tungsten, molybdenum, and many other rare and rare earth metals. Deposits of iron, manganese, and chromite ore reserves, for which Kazakhstan is one of the leading places in the world, are of extreme importance and global significance. For example, the proven reserves of copper in Kazakhstan is estimated at 6% of the world's reserves, or 37 million tons. 
the main volumes of balance sheet reserves are concentrated in the eastern and central Kazakhstan. В Казахстане добывают, как я уже сказал, различные типы руд. Это могут быть колчеданные руды, полиметаллические руды или кремнистые песчаные. There are various types of pyrite ores or silicious sandstone ores in Kazakhstan. Regardless of the composition of the processed ore and subsequent concentrates, at the beginning we receive blister copper, containing at the beginning of the order 98% of copper. Subsequently, the copper undergoes refining in two phases, firing and electrolytic stage. Electrolytic refining turns copper purity to 9,999. If necessary, Kazakhstan enterprises can obtain copper 99,999 cleanliness at the end. The quality of our copper meets international standards, including the requirements of the London Metal Exchange. Мед частотой 5 девяток. При получении вайербарсовой меди, при получении медной катанки. Таким образом, качество нашей меди отвечает мировым стандартам и в том числе требованиям лондонской биржи металла. Proven reserves of other valuable ore, chrome, in Kazakhstan is about 350 million tons. A predicted capacity exceeds this figure by several times. The country has about 20 deposits of chromium, which are almost all exploited. One of the largest and richest deposits of chrome ores in the world, the mine Sunrise in Aktobe region. Its proven reserves are about 20 million tons, and the ore lies so that its production is not too costly. According to specialists, 300 gold deposits have been discovered in the country, of which 173 have already been explored. With major investments, Kazakhstan in just a few years will be able to produce 100 tons of gold a year, but now it produces only 1% of its underground reserves, and this gives it the right to be in the top 10 gold countries in the world. The peculiarity is that in Kazakhstan, two-thirds of produced gold is accounted for copper and lead-zinc industries, where gold is a byproduct of production. No less important for the Republic's economy, mining and processing of lead, tin and zinc. Proven reserves of Kazakhstan's lead are estimated at almost 12 million tons, accounting for over 10% of world reserves. Stocks of lead in Kazakhstan is concentrated in more than 50 fields, and lead-bearing ore mining is carried out on 15 fields. This year is very significant. This year we plan to release 134,000 of lead. Until this last year we released a total amount of 126 million. That is, we move further in a crisis period. We decided to go the other way, to increase the volume and to produce more revenue to cut costs. On the territory of the country there is a necessary feedstock to produce ferrous metals. This iron ore, manganese ore and coking coal alloying metals. As the world's iron ore reserves Kazakhstan ranks 8, they account for 6% of the world's total. Of the nearly 9 billion tons of proven iron ore reserves, more than 70% are easy to mine. Kargan, the metallurgical plant, located in the city of Temertau, is the largest enterprise in the country for iron ore processing. The plant made a full metallurgical cycle, and different kinds of ferrous metals, sheep, long white plate, are produced there. Our metallurgical combination is a combination of closed metallurgical cycle. We produce steel or production of hot iron our metallurgical plant is a plant with a closed metallurgical cycle. We produce steel and the production of hot rolling, cold rolling production, production of valves, as well as the manufacture of the pipe, 
Since ArcelorMittal is a full-cycle plant, with our metallurgical raw materials we close 100% of our needs for coking coal and energy and where that 70% we close our needs for iron ore materials. Besides so-called quality iron, and steel industry are well developed in Kazakhstan. It is represented by Ferro Alley plants in Aktobe and Aksu. Уникальность нашего предприятия заключается в том, что на территории одного предприятия the unique feature of our company is that we produce silicious chromium and manganese alloys on the territory of the enterprise. In regards to the figures, the annual productivity of our company is more than 1 million tons. At the end of 2014, we produced over 1,300,000 tons. I would like to note that our products are supplied to Australia, the United States, the countries of European Union and Asian countries. Kazakhstan is rich in chemical raw materials and inventory. There are rich deposits of potash and other salts, bromine, sulfate, zeolite, shungite, phosphorite. In 2014, it started production of phosphate rock, the basis for the production of phosphate fertilizers and salts, in the field in southern Kazakhstan. During the year, the level of production reached 150,000 tons. Other mineral, shungite, which is called the mineral of the 21st century, are actively mined in the territory of Almaty region near the village of Main. On the world market, Kazakhstan Shungite was known under the trade name Torit. It can be used not only in medicine, but also in industry, construction, agriculture and other industries. Our company entered into contract with the government, namely the Ministry of Industry and New Technologies, for the exploration and extraction of mineral Shungite. Then about two years, our company was engaged in the exploration, and since 2005-2006, we began pilot testing, followed by the introduction of our material directly to the production plants. Kazakhstan zeolite differs with its unique characteristics, a mineral known for its ability to give back and reabsorb water, depending on temperature and humidity. Another important property is the ability of zeolite to iron exchange. It is the ability to selectively isolate and reabsorb various substances, as well as to exchange cations. All these properties are widely used for various needs, especially in hydro-cleaning facilities for cleaning land from petroleum products. And recently there is an interest in the zeolite as a fine material fertilizer. In 1991, when zeolite mine in Almaty region was discovered, it was decided to build a plant for the processing of mineral raw materials. In 1997, construction was completed and zeolite processing plant, the only such company to date in Kazakhstan, mining and processing of mineral raw materials zeolite. In addition to rare and valuable minerals in the country, not so exotic, but no less useful materials and sometimes vital for the economy extracted and processed in large quantities. This is an important strategic resource as drinking water for its reserves the East Kazakhstan region stands out the most. There are about 800 rivers and 2,000 lakes. In addition, there are three major reservoirs, Shulbinsky, Buhtarma and Uskomnagorsk. Other materials needed for the successful development of the construction sector – gravel, clay, marble, granite and limestone. There are an abundance in Kazakhstan, although in each case it requires solving complex problems sometimes. For example, the apparent ease of production of crushed stone, crushing rocks, is misleading. Since the modern technologies of production of building materials and products put greater demands on the quality of the gravel, used mainly as a filler in production of concrete, asphalt and pavements. The same can be said about the production of clay. To get to the red clay deposits, 
mine developers in the Almaty region has to open an impressive layer of so-called overburden. At the moment, we are working on the ledge, the ledge which we use for work. Our cars drive here, transporting these clays from the surface to dumps. Before we extract clay, we need to perform stripping, in order to remove gain, which overlap the clay. At the moment, you can see excavator behind me. There are machines that perform stripping to reveal clay that we need. This unnecessary clay that we remove from the first surface is stored in a single blade. It is to the left behind us. Cars are transporting them at the moment. We do not conduct extracting until all the necessary clay is taken away. Experts note that different regions of Kazakhstan are characterized by different minerals. The west of the country is represented by oil and gas, phosphates, chrome and uranium ore. Ore minerals of the western part of the country often can be seen in the southern part of the Urals within the Aktabe region. The eastern part of Kazakhstan is rich for non-ferrous metals, the main of which polymetallic. The largest in the CIS phosphorite deposits, deposits of polymetallic ores are in the southern region of Kazakhstan. There are manifestations of copper and iron ores. In most parts of the country, there are reserves of raw materials for the building materials industry. However, not all deposits are fully understood, and their exploration and development is one of the most urgent tasks for the Republic's economy.